Now then, a quick run through a few other things to re-examine exactly how this crisis started in South Sudan and where it is right now. Fighting, of course, erupted in the South Sudanese capital of Juba on the 15th of December between government forces and rebels loyal to the former Vice President Riek Machar. The violence then quickly spread and took on ethnic undertones, pitting ethnic Dinka loyal to President Salva Kiir against Nuer supporters of Mr Machar. Now, violence in the oil-rich Jongle state has intensified as opposing factions battle for control of the flashpoint town of Bor. Face-to-face -face talks in neighbouring Ethiopia on Sunday were delayed due to disagreements over the agenda. Now, the sticking points are how and when to begin a ceasefire and the rebels' demand for a release of what they describe as political prisoners. President Salva Kiir accuses the detainees of helping Machar to help an alleged coup attempt. So far, little progress has been made. Now, but Sudanese President Omar Hassan al-Bashir is expected to also push for negotiations to end the violence in planned discussions with President Kiir on Monday in Juba.